Hello, what's going on, Ipsters? Today I'm going to be talking to you about the September Ipsy bag of 2017. So the bag this month was like a boss theme. And the bag is a black faux leather bag with like these ridges, almost like spiky ridges. Very punk rockish type theme. Of course we got the gold zipper and inside there got the royal blue color. Uh, the tassel, of course, has Ipsy on it and a black leather tassel. So overall, I'd say this is a pretty cute bag. You can go neutral. You can stick it in any type of purse you want. Um, black is always good. And again, I like the edgy, punk rocky look. Very cool. First item I'm going to talk to you about is the face masks I had. Um, the brand is either Main Fit or Man Fit. I can't tell which one it was. So far, I've used the Pore Care, the um, Mugwort Astringent and Pore Care. And all, overall, that one was really, really nice. I immediately put it on my face and it immediately started working. It was very cool and hydrating to my face. And my face is already like smoother and the, my skin tone is evened out a lot more. I can definitely tell it's helping my pores. Uh, the Lily Whitening and Brightening one, I have yet to try. Um, I'm pretty excited to try that one. If it's as good as the um, Mugwort one, I'm pretty sure it'll be fantastic. Now, on the back of it, it says to apply them 10 to 20 minutes. Um, I usually do 15 minutes right in the middle just to be sure. So, um, that's what I do. Except for it does not say whether or not to use it in the morning or in the evening before you go to bed. So what I've been doing the last two times I've used the face mask was I did it a half an hour before I put my makeup on and it seemed to work. Um, please tell me in the comments below what your preference is and what you, why you feel like you put your face mask on at that specific time. Okay, so the second item that I'm gonna talk to you about is the Luxie Medium Angled Brush. Now this is my first eyeshadow brush that I've ever gotten again first glance I really like the pink and the rose gold color going on the bristles are really super soft and I really liked using it on my eyes um, I heard that the Luxie brush is a very um, it's not a cheap brush so the fact that Ipsy put it in their Ipsy bags is really really awesome and that this brush alone probably cost ten dollars or more so you got um, your money's worth just by this one brush. Um, I did hear that they're not animal cruelty free, so I'm not sure about that. But if they're not, then that's kind of a drawback for that. But still, I'm going to give it five stars because it is amazing. And I will definitely use this a bunch. Uh, the third item I'm going to talk to you about is the, the Pixie by Petra blush. It's a duo color in peach honey, and of course, this is actually a full-size container, which I'm excited about. Um, normally, I don't use blush because my face is already dry and rosy, and I just don't really like the rosy cheek look. But after putting on foundation and everything, and then putting this blush duo on, it's almost acting like a highlighter, and like it's really bringing out... Um, a natural color to my face that I really really like and the fact that it's very shimmery I love that too so props to this one I give this five stars plus because honestly I never thought I would like blush until I found this one so kudos to the uh, pixie by Petra the, the fourth one I'm going to talk about is Elizabeth Mott pop goes the eyeshadow and the color that I got was toasted and you can see it almost looks like a mocha cappuccino color that I really really like it would goes really well with a smoky eye I feel um, it does come out so you can put it in any other kind of container Z pack or whatever it is that you guys stick your eyeshadows in you don't have to keep it in this um, I just wish that the eyeshadows that Ipsy gave were like full-size eyeshadows because this is small and I could see myself using this a lot and running out. So maybe I'll have to invest in getting the full version. Um, but honestly, I really like it. It's shimmery and I am currently wearing it right now. It's very, very shimmery and I like it. 
and so I give that a five stars as well. Uh, the last item that I'm going to show you is the Smashbox uh, Photo Finish Primer Foundation. And this item I actually requested from Ipsy. I was able to look ahead, kind of at spoilers, at a few of the items that were going to be here for this month. And um, I looked this up online. Um, excuse me, I looked this up online on Ipsy at the spoilers because I uh, was really, really excited and impressed with my first bag. And so I was excited to see what the items were for this month. And this was one of the ones that I could have requested. And I decided to go with this one because I've never used primer before. I usually only use foundation for my uh, face and then I would apply makeup on my eyes and lips. Um, so I was really excited to try this. I really, really love it and I'm glad I picked it out. Um, and I'm glad I received it because it like highlights the natural um, curves of my face. And it really makes it smooth and it helps out with the foundation. I know that I've had problems with my foundation coming off on my when I'm talking to people on the phone. And it just doesn't last very long. And I don't really like that. And it makes my phone look gross. But I'm constantly cleaning it. So... Honestly, I really, really like this primer, and I'm contemplating about once I get done with this sample, I'm actually going to buy the full-size version of it because I really, really like it. And the fact that it's Smashbox, and I heard that's a really, really good brand, um... I'm really excited about this. I really, really am happy. So overall, I'm gonna have to say that I give my full Ipsy September bag a five out of stars plus. Um, this really, they really knocked it out of the park for me this month. And I was really, really impressed by all of the products and I really, really loved and enjoyed all of them. I'm gonna continue using them until they run out pretty much. Um, in the comments below, Feel free to comment the um, items that you got, whether they were the same or different, which ones that you liked that you were given, and also which ones you wish that you should have gotten if you didn't get any. Um, I look forward to hearing, uh, talking to you guys next month for the October version. Go October, it's my birthday month, so hopefully the Ipsy bag is extra special there. And um, as usual, stay beautiful, and I will talk to you guys later. See ya!